give you a nickname, okay? So I can talk to you during the procedure. We're going to call you uh, Pen Penbrook. All right. Penbrook. Penbrook, welcome to Texas. You're here from Florida, right? Yes, sir. Okay, you said you're uh, getting yes. ready to move here in just a moment. Okay. Yeah. So, um, welcome to our humble clinic. What happened to your ear, buddy? I have no idea. Honestly, um, it started as a little, little bump yeah. for a couple of months. And then in the last week or so, it really, really inflamed. Has it ever drained or anything like that? No. You ever squeezed on it real hard to see if you get it to drain? No. I was scared. <laughs> I think you've got an abscess here, and I'm not quite sure how this got started. Mm -hmm. I don't think that this is a cyst, though, okay? okay? Sometimes you can get cysts that can also get infected, but I think this is just a plain old infection or a simple abscess. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to numb this up with a little bit of lidocaine, and then we're going to stick a needle in it and see if we can't drain it for you. Right. How's that grab you? Sounds good. Sounds good. Sure. And you're okay if we video your procedure for all our friends on the internet around the world? Yes, sir. Pretty awesome. We like people from Florida, don't we? Yeah. I always said I wanted to do nursing in Florida. Okay, so what's going to happen next, Pembroke, is Gumby Jean is going to spray a super cold spray right on your earlobe. Mm -hmm. And the reason she's going to do that is going to numb it up, and then I'm going to actually inject it to get it even more numb. Okay. You ready? Yep. Here we go. She's spraying. Is that feeling cold? Oh, yeah. Now you're going to get a little stick. Or a bigger stick. And on. a burn. And a burn. That's right. How do we do? Sorry. Not bad, huh? Mm -hmm. Where do we play? Needle? Yeah, I have it. I must have thrown it away. We're going to give that just a moment to work. Okay. I'll see you in 16. Got the runaround, and I hope that uh, we're able to relieve this for you. Right. I think we should be ready to go. Let's do it. All right, I got the gummy jean. She's got some gauze. Hey guys. And we are just going to make a we're actually just going to make a, a little poke or a stick into this with a with a 18 gauge needle. And hopefully you are not going to feel there we anything. Go. Yeah, we got definitely have some pus coming out, don't we? Okay. Well, look at that. Almost went in the ear, didn't it? We got it. Dude, guess what? It's pretty flat. Ooh. Coming right out. Oh, great. I can't believe they don't want to do this for you at the VA. This I is don't actually know why. a this is a fun procedure for <laughs> us, you know. You get to do something that helps somebody, you know. Mm. Clears it right out. Okay, the infection should be all gone now. Let's give it just one second and we'll squeeze again one more time. And I wrote you a prescription for some antibiotics you're going to start taking. You're going to take them for about a week. Okay. This should not return. Now, I don't know how this got started again. It could have been a poke or a stick or a scratch or anything like that. Mm -hmm. uh, you should do... Oops, uh, that was just a little blood right there. Good thing that wouldn't pus, huh, Gumby Jean? Well, I'm glad they squirted <laughs> that way. Right, right. <laughs> Okay, so she's going to put a little bandage on you. You're oh, done. Yeah. How was that? Oh, that was quick and easy. Quick and easy. <laughs> Excellent. I think you're going to heal just fine with the antibiotics. We're also going to give you just a little shot in the butt today. Okay. And Brooke, you rock, man. Thanks for letting us proceed. <laughs> <Thank you. laughs> Did I say butt? Yeah. <laughs> well, it's true. It is, but thanks for letting us record your procedure. All right. Bye, guys. Hey, folks. You spoke and we listened. Here's what you had to say about Meta7. I love it so much. It gives me so much energy during the day. I've noticed a change in my hair, my nails, my blood pressure. There's no doubt that it, it's, it's a benefit to me. It gives me more stamina. And it could actually help you lose weight. Now, I haven't taken a nap in six months. That's right, Meta7. More and more people are sending in their testimonials. Weight loss, more energy, and generally feeling more alert during the day. Let's hear more. I used it to help wean myself off caffeine and energy drinks, and my productivity has been very high lately. It's natural, it's amazing. I feel motivated to get out and do things that I didn't before. I'm not tired during the day. I've worked 12 hour shifts. I just go, go, go all day. It makes me feel great, I love it, and um, take it. It's wonderful stuff. If you haven't tried Meta7 yet, it's time to order yours from Amazon. Time to boost your metabolism and kick your energy level into high gear.
There's an Amazon link in the description.